In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a custom URL for your LinkedIn profile so you stand out even more, and that's coming up right now. Hey there, Mark Warnkin here, your social media for business expert. And if this is your first time here, this channel is all about helping you grow your business or brand using LinkedIn, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and a whole lot more. So hit the subscribe button below to stay up to date with everything social media. I release videos just like this every week and you definitely don't want to be missing out on them. One of the simplest things we can all do with our LinkedIn profiles is make a custom URL for our name. But it's equally one of the things that most people just don't get around to doing. Now you're possibly even asking, Mark, what is a custom URL? Well, if you go to the top of your LinkedIn profile, you will see it's www.linkedin forward slash, and then it will be your name or your business name. LinkedIn allows you to do that, and that's called a customized URL. Now, if you don't actually do it, you end up with this big, long, jumbled code, and it looks a little bit ugly. So in this video, I'm just going to show you how to take away that ugly looking jumbled code and make it into a customizable URL with your name or your business name. All these little things are the little one percenters that add up in the online world. It will make you look a little bit more professional. It will actually help with the search results in LinkedIn. The more people that can find you on LinkedIn, the more opportunities will flow. So let's go to some live screen action now where you can follow my mouse and I will show you how to make a customized URL for your LinkedIn profile. And one. So here we are on my LinkedIn profile, Mark Warnkin. If we aren't yet connected on LinkedIn, by all means, send me a connection request. I would love to welcome you into my network. Who knows what opportunities may then flow for both of us. So going to the top of my profile here, www.linkedin.com forward slash I N Mark Warnkin. There is my customized URL already in action. So that's what we want to get to. Just makes it a little bit nice and neat, become searchable in LinkedIn. Remembering LinkedIn is many things, but it equally is a giant database and a search engine. So, um, and it's one of the simplest things we can all do, but equally, it's one of those things that so many people um, tend to miss out on and they just forget it. So that's what the objective we're trying to get to. And then, um, once it's done, it's done and you can then forget about it. So let's go to my newsfeed and see if we can find some um, other connections of mine who don't have a customized URL. Anthony, I'm connected to. He's a fellow was. He does some great things. So I know he does. Uh, here we go. Dan. Dan's a first level connection of mine. Let's click on Dan's profile and see what his URL comes up with. Here we go. So this is a good example. LinkedIn.com forward slash Dan dash uh, cl claw uh, claw were and see it's got this little bit of code at the end so it's only something very simple um, it's just one little thing that Dan could do to tidy up his LinkedIn profile a little, little bit more so there's an example of not a customizable um, LinkedIn URL so scrolling back to my news feed let's see if we can find another one now as well okay so Dan we found Simon Diana's another fellow Aussie she does some great stuff on LinkedIn I know she does as well here we are Kirk uh, Kenny, sales trainer at Freightliners Grand Rapids in Michigan. Love his profile, love what he's doing. But again, see up the top, linkedin.com forward slash IN forward slash Kirk um, dash Kenny. And then it's got the jumbled code after that. So that's what we're trying to avoid. We're just trying to tidy it up as per my one here. So how do we actually do that? How do we go and change the customizable uh, and make it a customizable URL. LinkedIn make it very simple. Look at this over here on the right hand side. Edit your public profile and URL. So when we click on that, it's going to take us to a new screen. Edit your custom URL. Personalize the URL for your profile. www.linkedin.com forward slash IN forward slash Mark Warnkin. We click on the pen and this is how simple it is. We would be able to take out that jumble code and add your own personal name, your business name, or a combination of both. And that's how simple it is. And once you press save, then it is saved. Now, your URL is just like any website. It's unique to you. So my suggestion would be to try and grab your name first. 
Um, you might then have to, um, you know, add a second name if, you're, if your name's a common name and it's already taken. You might want to add a combination of um, your name and your business name. But try and get your custom URL up and running. Um, as I say, you press save and then it is all done. The end result is that when someone's looking for you on LinkedIn, um, it's going to help slightly with the search results. Just tidies up your LinkedIn profile as well, makes everything look a little bit neater and makes you look that 1% extra uh, professional in the eyes of everyone online. So there we go. Hopefully you found this video informative, entertaining and helpful and you now have a customizable LinkedIn URL, whether it be your own name or your business name or a combination of both. I would love to hear from you. Put your customized LinkedIn URL below in the comment section and I will check out your LinkedIn profile. That way we can also maybe connect on LinkedIn as well. If you're watching this video on YouTube, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. If you're on my Facebook page, smash the like button, follow me on Facebook as well. Mark Warren could Social Media Selling 123 signing off, and I look forward to seeing you again in another one of my videos real soon.